Okay guys, so I am not going to be showing you how to do this glitch today, so if that's what you're here for, wrong video, wrong time. What I'm going to do is show you guys how to counter this, because this seems to be the new AFK method for people farming PvP. Now, I don't agree with this at all, which is why I'm not showing it. But as you can see on screen, we are on top of a mausoleum. A bloody mausoleum. And this is the new AFK method that everybody's doing because as you know, when you go into PvP, you can't use your torrent. So therefore, you can't get up here. The whole system just doesn't work. But this is what people are using at the minute. And they're essentially turning on the hunter and allowing the hunter to fight the Bloodfinger or the Rosa Clunk Clunk, I can never pronounce the freaking word, but irrelevant, they fight underneath and they gain runes from it by sitting on top of this mausoleum. Now, I don't agree with it whatsoever, so today we're going to show you guys exactly how to counter it because this is just not how it's meant to be played. It's kind of hard to imagine that PvP is still about the AFK method at all, and it's a little bit frustrating to think that, that it's not changed by now and there's not sort of like more of an enjoyable way for these guys to play the game but it's just where we're at right now so we're going to show you guys exactly how to counter this and this is a quite early game as well so if you guys just want to ruin some afk farmers day then head on down to Liania because this is where it's all going to be at on this corner. Now there is a very viable way to counter this and it is going to include the Jar Cannon. So if you've not got the Jar Cannon you need to go ahead and grab that and come back to this video with that Jar Cannon so you can go ahead and cause mayhem to those absolute butt wipes that are causing issues in the PvP scene. Now we're going to be starting this just here, right next to the main manor entrance, and this is going to be the main area where you guys are going to be able to essentially combat these AFK PvP players. Now you have to be careful with this because this is quite a distance away, and as we know, PvP, you can't jump on your torrent. But for all intensive purposes of the video, we are going to travel there on torrent just to make the video a little bit shorter for you guys so you can see the generic route that we're going to be taking. But we're going to be taking the far left-hand side from the manor as you were walking out of it, and we're going to be heading down to the main part at the bottom here where you've got the big rock surface that you're going to be crossing over this is going to be essentially as close to it as you can get without having one of the gray sites now we will get another gray site there in a, on a route in a second and hopefully this makes it a little bit easier at least but we're going to be heading right down to the cliff edge and as we get there you're going to see this big stone bridge Again, you're not going to be on torrent, so I am just going to drop off and you guys will also be able to do that on foot without causing damage. From there, we're going to be heading just up this hill and we're going to st stay towards the left-hand side and you are going to notice that we're going to get towards a set of stairs and that's where we want to make our maneuvering. Head up here and this is where the grey site is going to be, so the, the Bellum Highway. Now, this is a obviously a grey site which is probably not going to work too well, although you can attempt it here a few times and maybe there'll be somebody hidden up there but we're going to go through this main doorway right here and we are going to be following down till we get to the famous spot right at the bottom where there is a giant seal on the doorway a lot of you guys may have known this area from one of my probably more famous videos for a farming method just down here and we're going to see the left hand side now once you see this sealed doorway you know that you're in the exact place that we need to be from that sealed doorway, we're going to be taking a left round the side of the building and we're going to be dropping down onto the lower ledge from that point. At this stage, this is where the jar cannon comes in handy because you guys are going to be able to see the mausoleum from above. You now have the height advantage and as long as you've got the right bolts on on the jar cannon, you will be able to shoot directly over, causing the absolute mayhem to these AFK farmers on top of the mausoleum. Now, do make sure that you are aware that this mausoleum will turn around. So if you don't get the kill quick enough, then you are going to have to obviously either reset or wait. Or if you are not able to see anybody there, but you can see the icon and the marker and you're presuming that they're over there, then you just have to wait until that point is there and available. This is a very, very viable method and a very easy way to do it. We're going to shoot the jar cannon over right now so you guys can see exactly how this works. Now, the ones that we're using right now are the giant uh, great bolts, I think it is, the explosive great bolts, and these have a drop off. But with the electric ones, they don't have no drop off. It's a direct shot, it's a complete straight and down the narrow line where you guys are going to be able to just hit exactly where you want to. These explosive ones cause a freaking absolute ton of damage which is why i prefer using them as long as you can figure out how far the drop off goes you're able to shoot directly over and it's a nice and easy win
win for the books of the PvP players. Hopefully you guys do want to go ahead and do this and hopefully we can sort out PvP bit by bit, chunk by chunk. And if you guys have watched this far and you guys are those people doing the AFK farming, well, you're bloody toxic. Just stop. Anyway, thank you so much again for watching, guys. I appreciate all your faces. If you haven't already, smash that beautiful blue thumbs up and subscribe with post notifications turned on. But as always, up until the next time, I'll see you in the clouds.